former light welterweight and former welterweight champion of the world, Timothy Desert Storm Bradley. Former Latino and former WBA Intercontinental Champion, Diego La Hoya Chavez. You know, much more relaxed for this fight than he was when he fought uh, that uh, hard uh, war. And he's not afraid to engage, I assure you that. Now he's come out to try to turn this right away into a brawl. He wants to slug, and he'd like Bradley to slug with him. It's not what I believe is the best thing, but it's what I like to see. Oh, he got nailed with an uppercut inside. He comes right back with the right hand of his own, does Tim Bradley. And Chavez would like to be on the Timothy Bradley end of the purses of this one. Timothy wails that body, and there's a bit of a low blow by Chavez, and Tim loads up. About five right hands in a row. Yes, they can. That's an, uh, it, It's not just the cut. They can ding you. Big shot there. Is Tim. All right, we take a look at the last round's action, and there's a wild swinging overhand right by Bradley that was effective. Move a little, jab a little, box. Well, cut uh, over the eye. And now here's Tim chopping him right on top of where that cut is. Loading up right hands. He told us folks what Rich is talking about when we talked to Tim yesterday that, you know, Pacquiao is just at a different level. He says he's a better fighter than I am. And it's funny because Brandon Rios is the same sort of guy as Chavez. And Chavez uh, and Rios, you know, that one could have taken place in some barnyard someplace. Or on the wharf of the place. This one's more of a boxing man. Chavez not wilting in any way from this guy. He just gets nailed by two solid right hands. And then Tim whipped on the third one. There's been a lot of wild swinging between the two. An effective uppercut there. Carry on. The heads are going to come together all night. Because both of them tuck their heads when they come in. And when they're on the inside, they wag them. Here we go. Back to the pier sixer. Tony gets in there to separate the two. Nice left hook landed, then a right hand by Tim Bradley. Solid, good body shot by Chavez. Chavez. Chavez on his toes, loads up his right hand. <laughs> but it is uh, almost closing that left eye, and we're only in the sixth round. Some of those haymakers that Chavez is throwing him, you know, and it's that, that right hand right there to that uh, left eye of Tim Bradley. Oh, Tim caught him with a right hand, but he didn't shift uh, Chavez at all. And Tim, Tim is a very confident guy, uh, and more so of late. He seems to know exactly what he wants to do with his career. And he certainly made that clear, because in the rounds that he did draw, Rich, he won the rounds. Not as many as Tim has landed. Of course, the fight is that Bradley probably got the most praise from. If, this, if the fight with Mayweather and Pacquiao does come about, he goes, uh, I, I tell him, he says, I tell him, what are you talking about? There's some hard stuff going on right now. Christina, I got a question for you. Is this the uh, same Tim Bradley that you've seen in the past? Oh, solid right hand landed by Tim that time. Chavez will get so frustrated thinking he's behind in the fight that he'll start roughhousing him again. And hopefully. Chavez at this stage in this round is out boxing with Timothy. But I think he has to be a little wary because of the eye. Here he goes with a nice uh, left hand, right hand right behind it. Tim looks like he's got two golf balls in his cheeks. Right. He's uh, winning the last couple of rounds. Out boxing Tim. This round's more even. 
Tim cracks him with the right hand behind the left ear. It won't take top rank long to match him up for a world title fight again, that's for sure. Well, we know who it won't be against, Terrence Crawford. Closing seconds now of the fight. Been a very good fight. Bradley raises his hands, Chavez raises his hands, but Tim Bradley's won this fight.